Hi all, welcome back to another video. So this is Michelle, she's coming for a infill slash redesign. So I've already prepped her now, so I've took the original set that she had on. She had them on for over six weeks. Um, she only lost one, which is good for Michelle. Um, so here I am, I've done all my prep work, and now I'm just doing the clear layer on her nails, just so we've got obviously something to file back to for when she comes back for another redesign. Um, so it's just the um, the growth that I'm in feeling at the tip really, and the one on her pointer finger, obviously I'm doing the whole nail. The clear acrylic I'm using today is Crystal Glass from CJP and on her baby finger here um, I'm, I wanted a peach colour um, and peach sorbet was obviously it's just more of a nude colour I'd say um, and I have chilli pepper from CJP as well but that's just a little bit too bright so I mixed the two together so I mixed peach sorbet and just a kind like a tiny pinch of chilli pepper so like, I'm, so like I'm doing a cooking video but anyway, um, and this was the colour it made, um, so I'm doing a full nail on her baby finger, and then over the top I've got Indigo's um, Mermaid Glitter, um, I think, I've, I've, the label's come off of it, but it's just that, um, that, that di a glitter that you rub into a gel from Indigo. Um, yeah, the, the name's come off, sorry. So yeah, I'm just picking up a little... Um, wet beads and just painting it, dipping into that glitter and painting it on the nail just so it gives it more of a shimmer. And on her ring finger, I'm using that same coloured acrylic that I made, um, and I'm doing an ombre with this. So I'm putting that at the tip um, and fading it down. And then I apply peach sorbet to the tip and blend that into that colour.
on the pointer finger here, I'm doing a full glitter now. So this is Nouveau light gold, and then over the top is light gold chunky glitter from Nao. The fine glitter Nouveau light gold was just from the range. And on her thumb, I'm just picking up that peachy colour that I made and peach sorbet and just keeping them wet and just blending them together to try and make... It was, didn't really turn out to be a marble, it kind of just turned out to be a blob of different colours. But she was happy. So I just do the same on her other hand, so I'm just going to whiz through this.
I forgot to record that part, but I just made a triangle around a cuticle area of peach sorbet, let it sit, and then I filed it into a more crisp triangle, um, removed any dust, and then I'm going in with white, um, which is um, Snow White from Crystal Glass, and I'm just going to do, just drag it up to that wall that you've built, getting right up into the corners, and I'm just going to try and do the same sort of thing in a thinner design. Um, this was my first time doing this, so it was a little bit tricky. Um, I have kept it in real time just so you can see how I was working with it. Um, but yeah, so it was my first time, so, you know, don't hate on me. It was more trickier than I thought. It really was. <laughs> So while I was waiting for those to set each time, I go on to do different things. So here I'm just going to cap all her nails in crystal glass. And then while I was waiting for the second hand to set, I just fold them into shape. Just so you're not waiting around, so you're just constantly doing something.
So now I fold the white nice and crisp and then I come in with the gold glitters, so the fine gold and the chunky gold um, and just doing the same again like I did with the white. So again, just filing that gold glitter nice and crisp, and then I come in with that glitter, that peach colour that we made, that we made, that I made, um, and just put it on the rest of the nail, the tip of her nail. Um, and then once that's dry, I then cap that entire nail in crystal glass.
So I then filed all her nails, which I forgot to record, I do apologise. Um, buffed her nails nice and smooth and then I asked my client to go and wash her hands. Um, and then it's time for top coat. So I'm using Kiara Sky's No Wipe Top Coat. And just apply that to all her nails and curing in my LED lamp for 60 seconds. I then apply cuticle oil and that is the set complete. Um, I was really happy considering it was my first time I was doing that colour blocking. Um, I guess it's practice, practice, practice. Just hope that some of my other clients will let me do that on them. Helen is trying to talk to me, doesn't know that I am doing a voiceover. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you don't subscribe to my channel already, please do. Um, and until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.